black and white network fans. We are back with another video and we're going to be talking about the Supreme court. You guys know what happened to uh, Brett Kavanaugh actually what didn't happen to him. I'm actually happy to say his life was under attack. The left wing is going completely crazy over the leaked draft opinion of Roe versus Wade. It looks like it's actually going to be going away. But these leftists out there are getting so extreme now that they're actually endangering the lives of Supreme Court justices. And of course, you know, people on the left, Joe Biden, I haven't heard anything uh, from Joe Biden, Nancy Pelosi, Chuck Schumer about them condemning this stuff. This is completely insane, folks. And of course, you know, you have this uh, group that's been out there called Ruth sent us left wing extremists out there uh, protesting in front of um, Supreme Court justices homes is illegal. But guys, as we have seen. The rule of law does not apply to the left. That is why there has been no investigations into what actually caused the riots of 2020. This is why the left is focusing strictly on January 6th. You know, because if you are on the left and you burn down, ride and loot and all that other stuff, they're going to bail you out. Kamala Harris did that. But the January 6th people have been treated very, very unfairly. Well, let's talk about another Supreme Court justice here. Amy Coney Barrett. That is the new target now for the left. And Amy Coney Barrett has, I believe, if I'm not mistaken, seven children. Well, guys, it looks like Ruth Sinas is coming for Amy Coney Barrett's children. Check this out over here on Fox News. Ruth Sinas group hinted at targeting Supreme Court Justice Barrett's children and church. Because the uh, radical left, they hate Christians. Um, I already put up a video on what happened in um, Lakewood Church out here in Houston. Similar activists doing the same thing, stripping down in the church, screaming, using profanities in the church, disrupting services. This is what these people want. But it seems like, you know, ever since um, the gentleman the other day was arrested for trying to kill Brett Kavanaugh, the left is not putting a stop to these demonstrations in front of Supreme Court justices homes. This is illegal. But like I said before, if you're on the left, the rule of law does not apply to you. Let's read this, guys. Pro-choice group Ruth sent us hinted at targeting protests at Supreme Court Justice Amy Coney Barrett after the attempted attack on Justice Brett Kavanaugh. Ruth sent us posted a call for demonstrations at Barrett's home and church in response to speculation that she will concur with a previously leaked draft court opinion that would overturn Roe versus Wade. A Department of Homeland Security report said the Supreme Court draft opinion has unleashed a wave of threats against officials and others and increased the likelihood of extremist violence. Yeah, I'm wondering if we're going to have any uh, committees form to investigate all of this. Is it going to happen? Folks, it needs to happen. It needs to happen, but it's not going to happen with uh, Democrats in control. But they tweeted this out here. You can see here. If you're in the D.C. metro area, join us. Our protests at Barrett's home move the needle to this coverage. Falls Church is a people of praise stronghold. She sends her seven kids to a people of praise school that she set on the board of directors for. She attends church daily. They are coming for Amy Coney Barrett now. This needs to stop, folks. Joe Biden needs to step up and condemn this. There needs to be people arrested for this. These people are breaking the law. You cannot threaten Supreme Court justices just to get the ruling in your favor. That is illegal. These people are breaking the law. But like I said before, if you are on the left, the rule of law does not apply to you. This is insane, folks, because 
They just arrested a guy the other day, had a gun. He was planning to kill Brett Kavanaugh and the left has done nothing. Nothing. These people are still going to be showing up at the homes of Supreme Court justices. But they don't care. What I really think that um, Nancy Pelosi, Joe Biden, you know what they really want? They want conservative Supreme Court justices to get picked off one by one. When I mean picked off, they want them assassinated. I wouldn't doubt it because that way Biden can go in and throw in some other crazy socialists like um, uh, Ketanji Brown Jackson to take over the Supreme Court. This is what they want, folks. They want this to happen. And you may be saying, man, that's kind of extreme right there. You know that um, that these people want to uh, kill the conservative justice. Yeah, I do believe that's that's what they want. I truly do. I do not. Uh, tr- I don't trust the American left. I absolutely do not. Look what they did in, um, in 2020. 30 people killed. Antifa was running amok, burning down stuff, attacking people. They were not arrested. This is what the American left wants. The American left is extremely violent. And it's sad, folks, you know, that uh, Amy Coney Barrett has young kids at that. They don't need to be exposed to any of this. They don't. I said before, guys, that all of these Supreme Court Supreme Court justices need to have 24 hour Secret Service protection for the justices and their immediate family. And anybody that protests in front of a Supreme Court justice's home, the rule of law needs to be enforced. These people need to be arrested. And the punishment is only something like, if I'm not mistaken, upwards of a year in jail. That's pretty much it. Chances are probably wouldn't get that much. But hey, the left, they will not even arrest these people. This is wrong what they're doing, man. They're targeting these people. They're targeting our Supreme Court. Folks, I don't know about you, but this seems like somewhat of an insurrection. You know, the word that the left likes to throw around. Yeah. Yeah. That's just my thoughts on this. What do you guys think of this? Black and white network fans. Let us know what you think about all this in the comments. Make sure to subscribe to the channel. And we'll catch you next time. Black and White Network supporters, make sure you check out the Black and White Network merchandise store. Link in the description. Use promo code USA First, all one word. USA First, all one word. 25% off now. Thanks.